What's up YouTubers, welcome back to the channel. Hope everyone's doing well out there. For today's video, we're checking out this, my Wellagen Overdrive Special Amplifier, the closest amp I'll ever get to owning a real Dumble amplifier. So let's go. dive into the playing part of today's video, let's do a quick background check slash spec check on the amp. So like mentioned in the previous scene, this amp is a Wellagen Overdrive Special Amplifier. Probably, in my personal opinion, the highest quality Dumble clone you can get in today's market. I had originally ordered this amp in the summer of 2017 and it arrived to me January 2018 right before I headed to that same year's NAMM show. And since then, you've probably seen it on the channel. Most recently, you've probably seen it in a head enclosure with a 1x12 cab. But since its most recent revoice, I put it back in the original 1x12 combo, purely for aesthetic purposes in my office slash studio. I thought the 1x12 one, the one cab with the, um, the head enclosure was a big, too chunky for the room. Speaking of revoices, this amp has been revoiced twice. Most recently, it's been revoiced to sound very much in the same vein as Dumble Overdrive Special number 173. And the reason why it had it sent back to LA for a revoice was because over the past two or three months, I've had the pleasure of playing five real Dumble amplifiers, as well as another Wellagen Overdrive Special. And through that process, that really dialed my ear into what I really wanted to hear from my amp, you know? And Yele nailed that revoice, and it was a pleasure to work with him really over the past six years on this amp. It's a great amp. Spec wise, this amp is a 100 watt 6L6 based amplifier. Um, cascading gain. I do have a GE vintage short plate gray. 7025 12AX7 tube in the overdrive section. Um, and speaker wise, I am running a Celestion Redback 150 watt speaker. That's the background check slash spec check. Let's dive into the real part of this video, the tones. So let's go. check out some more tones. I also want to really explain some of the qualities that I look for that I wanted in this specific amplifier because very much like the Dumble Ethos, Yella is able to tune these amplifiers to you the player's needs and wants and that's what he did for mine and nailed it. So in the previous clips you would have heard some tone demos of Robin Ford's revelation, focusing on the clean to overdrive transition. Larry Carlton's all in good time, focusing only on the overdrive channel. And John Mayer's I'm gonna find another you, focusing on the clean channel. So if we go a bit more in depth, let's focus first on clean. Clean channel is what I mostly use here in my office slash studio most of the time when it comes to Zoom lessons. 
And one thing that's evident in Dumble Cleans is that they're very strong, you know? Comparing my Deluxe Reverb to the Overdrive Special, yes, it's really not a fair comparison, but the Clean Channel, what's instantly obvious is the strength and body of the Overdrive Special. So check this out. Nice even chord. That's a great clean tone, super smooth, and it still has clarity even on the neck pickup, which I love. Now, let's focus on the overdrive channel. I am not personally a user of super high overdrive. So when voicing this amp, and with the EQ and setting that it's at now, I really wanted the overdrive to be an extension of the clean tone so that when switching between the two sections, it's not a night and day difference sounding like I'm going to a completely different amp for the overdrive, which is why I focus a lot on the Robin Ford Revelation progression, because to me, that's a perfect demonstration of how an amp can go from clean to overdrive smoothly with just one click of a button, right? That's a great tone and a great transition from clean to overdrive, which I really wanted. Is that the specific Robin type tone? Not really, but that's what the mind that I get in when I play that chord progression or just anything like that. And then finally, let's check out this preamp boost, right? That bypasses the tone stack, which to me on the lead channel kind of makes it a bit more aggressive and in your face. So let's do something like a rugged road, for example. <laughs> That's a great lead tone if you want to go kind of like balls to the wall. <laughs> so those are the tonal qualities that I wanted out of my amplifier, right? And what I look for in dumbbells in general, a great clean tone, a smooth transition from clean to overdrive. And then when engaging the preamp boost, it just takes that lead channel over the top. Well, all right, guys, that is today's video. Kind of an amalgamation of Dumble Talk with a kind of review of my Wellagen Overdrive Special Amplifier. If you enjoyed today's video, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. <laughs>